you know, along this whole battle, the struggle, what are some of the nuggets of dumb advice that, that you heard along the way, or maybe even that you tried out and you realize, okay, that was not helpful. That made things worse. Um, I'm thinking of all the stories of other women that I've heard, but, um, um, for me, I know other women have heard like things like, um, just have more sex with him. Um, as if like, which is the most ridiculous thing because like, if you were dealing with someone who had a drug addiction, it wouldn't be like, go do Coke with him. So that makes absolutely no sense. Um, but I think um, things that were very quick fixy that like you need to leave him or you need to stay like something that was just like just solve it now and you'll be good um, because I didn't really see what was happening. Um, I remember coming across a book which in this betrayal community, this author is um, <laughs> very well hated <laughs> and, or perhaps his content. We don't know him. His content has been very misleading. Um, that uh, guys are just visual whenever that's used in a way that sounds like it's an excuse. So we just have to understand that like guys are just visual and that's just the way it is. And period. It's like, there's no hope for the guy there. There's no hope for us. Like, actually, nobody's winning with that kind of content. So um, I guess, like, part of me was just like, really? Like, I, if this is true, I want to be single forever. But I, part of me was just like, there's more. There there has to be more than just like, oh, it, you know, it is what it is. And, like, having authors, like, um, make unnecessary descriptions in books to like what kinds of women like what their bodies looked like mm -hmm. what kinds of women would like tempt them I'm like that this is very inappropriate in this book this is supposed to help me heal not give me more like triggering things yeah no I mean just not to jump in but to jump in uh I, I remember <laughs> hearing a lot of people recommend to me years ago um the every young man's battle series every young woman's battle and, you know, very popular in evangelical circles. But I mean, to be honest and frank, you know, I'm, I'm sure the intentions of the author were good, but it was not chaste. I mean, it would almost seem like they were trying to make purity sexy. And, you know, where the author's like, I remember seeing this image and the woman would look like this and she was doing that. And, and I'm, I'm reading this. I'm like, I don't need those images in my brain to help me be pure. And, you know, the books for the girls, like every young woman's battle, it'd be like, well, this term refers to a woman is doing this with it. And I'm like, what do we really need to be going into this with like 15, 16 year old girls to help them wear their chastity ring? Like, I don't think it's necessary. And so you might have approaches that are abstinence based, but truly lack purity. And, you know, in the process of trying to heal the wound, I think you're inadvertently infecting it. And so I'm, I'm glad you're, you know, I don't have a problem calling out names and stuff with you know, approaches that I disagree with. There might be a lot of good stuff there, but you got to be careful just handing this stuff out thinking, Hey, you know, this is real popular in these circles. Just hand it out. Cause once I finally read that, I'm like, okay, I'm not going to recommend this one anymore. Good intentions, but I think the approach is lacking. I'm very glad that you brought that up. Cause that's actually the book I was thinking about. <laughs> hey there. I hope you enjoyed that little clip, but if you want to see the whole episode where this came from, just click the link here. And in the meantime, we want to invite you to help us share this message. And there's a couple things you can do real quick. Number one, if you like or comment or share this video, YouTube will actually show it to more people. Also, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell. We release videos every single day and you'll be notified as soon as those come out. If you want to help us also to spread this message, you can support us at patreon.com slash Jason Everett. That helps us to create these videos and show them to the whole world. God bless.